Our first guest tonight is the youngest of 14 brothers and sisters, and so far, she is the one with the most Grammys of all of them. This spring, she celebrated her 10th anniversary performing at the Coliseum at Caesars Palace in Las Vegas, and she has a new album called Love Me Back to Life coming out November 5th. Please let your applause go on for Celine Dion. <laughs> You know, you I, I grew up in Las Vegas, where you uh, currently reside and uh, make hundreds of millions of dollars, which I did not while I was there. <laughs> I lost a few hundred dollars. Well, we already have something in common. So yeah, you know I guess Vegas so. very well. Do you like uh, being in I Las Vegas? I love being in Las Vegas. It's uh, an amazing, if I may say, an amazing... I can't believe it's been 10 years that I've been there. And it's an amazing uh, privilege. Privilege as singer to be able to be in an exquisite theater, 4,000 theaters. I'm there uh, almost every night. And, um, and it's it, great it's, because it, instead of touring all over, people come to you from all over. Well, sometimes I go to them, sometimes they come to me. But I have to say that it, it, it's amazing. I, I have to tell you that story. Normally, it's pretty, pretty steady cruise. You know, it's like the, it's loungy and it's calm. And, and about three weeks to a month ago, something that never happened in the theater before, which struck me big time. I was about to start uh, all by myself, so when I was young, when I started to sing and all that, uh -huh. I'm gonna start it now. <laughs> and, and, and then, uh, make a long story shorter, um, a start fight started, a fight started. Okay. A big fight. A fist fight at a Celine Dion concert. <laughs> Turned out to be almost like 